yeah welcome to our nan mudalvan ibm projects um in this video we're going to discuss about the uh, squid that is a uh, street quality identification project under the, the domain name is called as internet of things that is iot here we have descri described in the my our team id and this is my i am i am the team leader of uh, this is my esmology uh, from third year cse department from ali mohammad ali college of engineering and also we have uh, i have with the three team members one is abdul kayyum mohammad zafar and abdul badud uh, along with us in this video we are going to discuss about um, uh, entire project work about uh, street quality identification that is uh, squid uh, what are the prerequisites uh, using the how to create the ibm account and uh, how to create uh, uh, how to log in the ibm watson iot platform and uh, how to do download and develop uh, deploy the node red services we got to discuss about and also how we are configuring the ibm watson devices and um, obviously how to develop the device code either python or c++ or basing based on a crack detection code um, after that we have an, we are going to explain about the ideation phases like uh, empathy map brainstorming and idea prioritization and uh, technology stack, stack solution architecture proposed solution solution requirements and uh, and more so in this video today before i start, before i going to enter the project work we're going to first we're going to describe about the use case of uh, this uh, project this uh, in this the use case is our this is our use case for a street quality identification in the, under the given in the description in an age of autonomous vehicles cities and municipalities need digital tools to ensure that their streets are well maintained at that cost why we are using uh, the this type of uh, connection connectivity why we are going cities and municipalities we got a riding a car and uh, driving the bike riding a bike or driving a car itself sorry uh, we gonna need some net net needed to we are, why we are while we are uh, driving a uh, by traveling some traveling to other places some cracks will be here like uh, you got some uh, they are carving the the road uh, they play they leading the leading the pro road management and uh, to uh, uh, they are relating again and uh, the road and uh, because of uh, some cracks are uh, here because of due to a uh, uh, maybe some natural disasters like uh, maybe some uh, earthquakes tsunamis uh it is three uh, heavy rainfall too so after that it uh, they ante need it for uh, this the using the digital tools like uh, some arduino based we have seen uh, then uh, we have a uh, so more equipments we are, we are using this we are getting output uh, getting uh, right output uh, so that uh, the program will be executed with that uh, low uh, lowest cost ever that's why they have well maintained their streets at the at the very low lowest cost to this end we have created squid a low cost data pro platform that integrates open source technology that is they have said no this is sort a of low cost um, data platform is this is used to save or um, money to get rid of a money huge money that um, while we are developing our project to combine street imagery and uh, ride quality data to provide a visual ground truth for all the city streets uh, they they are um, sir they are um, they are surveillancely we have uh, they are maintaining the the like a uh, cctv cameras uh, like uh, uh, we are attached with a detached camera so and we are, che we are checking go through for go through check for that uh, ride quality data to provide a bit uh, the ground uh, that 
Okay, seeing the girl, how many cracks are happened here and uh, in the the road or in the street or a land something we can able to detect some crack detection so that we can able to identify in a binary mode after we are getting a real output from here to what we are taken from the original image it converts to the binary image that is either binary means we, are, we know there is either zero or one bits after showing the original two will be output image will be like a binary like black binary image like a what exactly black and white uh, black and white color right in terms of implementation the device is mounted to the black back of a city vehicle with its camera facing downwards to the road that's why before i that's i said before no it's a there's a small camera which is a back of the back of the car maybe a car or a cycle or should be a bike or should be a lorry or should be a van any type of vehicles it will be is applicable for for a detached camera they are facing downwards to the road they are they are setting to we can so that we can able to see the downward see the cracks see the road what they see facing to the downwards what they have how many cracks are uh, happened here and uh, there are so many um, cracks we have available how we can able to detecting we can able to identify it right um, coming back to this here is a social impact it is used to decrease accidents and increase a vehicle health condition right uh, in this yeah in day to day life we are, we have faced many they have faced many accidents and uh, few few of the people uh, they sacrificed their life because of their accidents and uh, they are, the major cause of accident is a cracking effect in the road because some um, in uh, in tamil language they say pallam thondirke thondirke they are explaining like that like the, they are carving and the, the road and so that's it they are not laying properly at the time right even though we are put, putting a tar, laying a tar to the old road some places won't be affected some, some place won't some place won't be a proper laden laden in the road right so that that's a major cause of a uh, decrease accidents and uh, that's a ma that's a major cause of uh, all the accidents and uh, in day by day uh, in year wise as we said as the statistics of a year wise uh, regarding accidents more than 500 or 1000 plus uh, accidents happened because of the crack 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 efforts right and we should able to detect it while we are using this uh, this type of uh, equipment and uh, also it increases the vehicle health condition right uh, with this uh, with this equipment we can able to identify how the vehicle run, runs on there how is there any cracks uh, got, uh, got stuck into the vehicle or not so we are just uh, checking to uh, checking the uh, plat uh, down to the platform how many cracks are held there so we are just able to detect and identify them right then coming to the uh, business model or an impact it it uh, it decreases road complaints to government in so many places we are uh, where the people they are giving the paper they are concerned in the complaints to the government because in the one place is one place that the the road is not properly laid at another place is that happened at another place because some rain heavy rainfall will happened and uh, this place also this was this place also road was not laid properly because of uh, earthquake and some major uh, natural disasters will happen or either man-made disasters also happen there so that's the reason they are they are uh, they are protesting protesting against when we are not doing the uh, properly letting the road prop 
letting the road properly so that's a, a, i'm i'm uh, they experience once some places you got a uh, got stuck to their vehicles and uh, also they uh, even big vehicles also they are affected severely by uh, cracking efforts so this is we are in this type of uh, equipment or a uh, requirement we can able to solve this problem by using this arduino based uh, equipment something uh, uh, maybe is yes, the proper uh, let it letter road so this will be able to prevent the more number of accidents and it, it decreases more so that's why that's why it is it decreases road complaints to government right then coming to the recommended type technology stack we in this project python is used flax is there used computer vision is used and a uh, raspberry pi pi that is used but in this uh, project we have a uh, implemented python code and then arduino based uh, fault detector uh, source code and also how the node red services they are implemented it so that's why they given in the reference in the below the they given in the link in the reference below that is um, https slash uh, maker dot pro slash arduino slash tutorial slash how to build a fault detector with the arduino they given the the link below so in this web in this link we can able to uh, able to clarify the things regarding uh, uh, regarding this project right then we are skipping to the um some uh, then next we are skipping to the next video as well so as of now this much is enough so what to do what how then in the next video how we are going to uh, and upcoming in the next video what how how we have to create a ibm account creation how we have to uh, how the ibm how to in signing the ibm was an iot platform and also under that how to create a config create and configure device and um, how to install a node red and how to how to deploy them and uh, and many more to explain so in this video it's a it's just about the introduction in this first video next video will be this then as yes, i know the ibm install ibm cre cloud creation what's an iot platform install in creation and um, node red installation we are how to, how we are uh, install and uh, how to develop the device sources so we uh, we got to explain in the next video but as of it as of now we're just ending the first video itself thank you